to the Pilates Show Mondays outside the Pilates studio, where we take our Pilates brain and body out into the real world. I'm your host, Casey Marie Hurt, and today we're gonna be talking a little bit about repetitive mind patterns. Now, in the Pilates studio, we talk and delve into and try to problem solve lots of ways to get people out of their physical movement patterns. It's also really important to take care of your mind in the same way. I got um, a wonderful recommendation from my uh, life, coach, life coach, Jaris Hollander, about this workbook called The Mindful Way Workbook. And what it is, it's about really delving into the ways that you can ruminate and stagnate in your mental capacity, which is really holding you back from vibrant mental and emotional health. Now, at first it seemed a little daunting when she uh, suggested this to me, but it's so well thought out and really gets to the heart of, of issues like anxiety and depression and repetitive thinking patterns. It's really important to remember that we're not just physical beings on this plane, right? We have emotions, we have our mental sphere, and it's important to, to really understand ourselves and our perception of the world so that we can be a little bit more gracious to to us and the and the people around us so physical freedom is wonderful and so is emotional and mental freedom and through this neuropositive type feedback and mindfulness we can really change the way that we think about ourselves and the world around us and uh, and really start to uh, be a little bit more compassionate in everything that we do. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any comments, you can comment below on Facebook, Twitter, or a forum.